Hey, it's Robert, and today we're bringing you along on a recent stay at Aria in Las Vegas this past December. We spent one night in a standard king room and then two nights in a Sky Suites king room. If you're considering visiting Aria anytime soon, then I hope this video will be helpful for you. Our first night, we decided to have dinner at Julian Serrano Tapas, someplace that we always previously ignored. And here's a tip for you. If you ever visit, request to be seated in the rear dining room. It's a much more luxurious ambiance than the main dining room and almost feels like an entirely different restaurant. was surprisingly amazing, but we were still hungry, so we made a quick stop for some gelato. Our first night, we stayed in a deluxe strip view king room on the 20th floor. It was definitely nice, but these rooms are about due for a refresh. The next morning, it was time to visit the fitness center, where I've been many times. This has to be one of the best hotel gyms on the Strip. After our workout, we were able to move to a king room within the Sky Suites tower on the 29th floor. This definitely felt like a significant upgrade, a completely elevated experience from Aria's standard rooms. After checking into our new room, it was time for dinner, and we had reservations downstairs at Carbone, which is consistently recognized as one of the best Italian restaurants on the Strip.
Staying in the Sky Suites Tower is unequivocally the best way to experience Aria. And being in Vegas during the holiday season made this trip that much more fun.